Speed run, let's go. Good day, everybody. Welcome to Sonic Tooth Me. I'll see you in today. We are doing something I've never done before, which is a speed run. So, this is going to be quite exciting. If you do enjoy this video, please make sure to subscribe to this channel. It'll be really appreciated. And also, turn on post notifications to receive instant notifications of when I upload my videos. And also, smash that like button to let me know about making decent content. So, let's get started. Um, so, the first thing we need to do is gather some wood and also some cobblestone. It looks like we spawned in a an abandoned village thing. What are these called? A ow. Fuck, that scared me. Right. Um. Yeah, the zombie villagers. This is a zombie village. Oh, I'm screwed. Right. Are there any chests in these? I can't remember. I haven't been in one of these for a long time. Ah. There is iron armor, which is good, and an iron pickaxe. Let's put this on before I die. Also, some logs. Let's kill this guy. Um. There's some. There's some um, lava, but I'm not sure if I'm going to be using it. Um, right, so there is this. So there's some apples, which is good. Um, also take a bed, just in case. Um, there should be a timer up on the screen to show how far I've got. Right, so I also would like some pumpkins so I don't get attacked by Enderman in the first few seconds. The first thing we need to get is stone and iron. Um, so we can make another portal quickly. Oh, so there's iron down here, so we might as well just turn these into logs. And um, We don't need much iron for armour because we've already got that covered. Um, because we were lucky. But um, we just need to find uh, a lava pool and then we're all set. Hopefully there's another fortress nearby. Um, I've not played on this. This was literally just created randomly. I'll put the seed in the description if I remember to. Um, but this is a hardcore world, so I must not die. If I die, then everything's over. Right. Make a crafting table. Let's make a furnace. Let's put that in there. Um, I'll see if I can find any coal down here that will make life <gasps> oh wow that was close right um so there's an abandoned mine shaft down there oh my goodness this goes down quite far if we can find some diamonds that would be amazing but um i was only looking for coal but looks like we found something far greater right so my furnace is up there um so if we just bridge over here, collect this, um, collect this coal, and then go back, then we should be fine. Um, we can always come down here, see if we need any, uh, if we need any redstone, then we'll be set. Um, right, so, that's done here. I'll try not to edit this as much as possible, so I'll try not have any pauses in my speaking. Um, I'll try. I, I need practice with that anyway. So, yeah. Uh, let's come up here. There's a little cobblestone generator there, but uh, doesn't matter. Right. So let's tower up here. See if we can collect our iron. Where is? Where was? Where was where we were at? Ah, it's up there. I'm so glad that we didn't die going down. So um, one, two, three, four. Uh, then we can just then we can just build up here. Um, I'm actually never done anything like this before. Now, I was watching some of Dream's videos and I noticed that he was doing speedruns and I just thought it might be an idea to start by doing a normal speedrun and then we can kind of take some of his ideas and or just create new ideas and see if we can do some more speedruns in the future alongside my Skyblock series. Yeah, um, I'm... So yeah, I'm pretty happy with how the skyblock's going at the moment, but um, it would be nice to have something going on the side. So let's collect this iron that we got, and um, we can we can make a couple of buckets because we will need those, and also we can make ourselves um, a couple of iron tools. See if we've got any wood left in here. 
but we're lagging. But yes, we have got some wood left. So we can make some sticks, we can apparently not know how to make a sword, and we can also make an axe. But I want to go wood chopping in a few minutes anyway, so first thing we need to do is we need to collect some water. So there's water right here, which is very good. And then we just need to find a lava pool and we can we can be on our way with going to the nether. So let's let's jump down here and try and find a lava pool. Um, so let's jump down here. There is some redstone. I'm not sure if this is going to be useful, but it might be useful for the levels if we ever do end up enchanting anything. We might be able to get some basic level enchantments with this. Um, it might be handy if we could get some diamonds, but it doesn't really matter. Right, we've got diamonds. We've got one diamond. That's a bit sad, but it doesn't matter. Um, that's. I only really need five levels, so I can get. I can get four of my. I can get four of my armor, and we've already got a lava pool, so that's very good. Um, so if we put this here, hopefully it doesn't spread too much. Um, let's try and make a nether portal. Right, so let's just do this way for now, because this will be this is the easiest way to make a nether portal without diamonds. Um, so let's do this. Then we only need two more down here I've done this completely wrong um, so I have to have another one here and then then do this way um, then we only need one more and we're set now we just need to find some gravel hopefully there's gravel nearby um, if there's not then I'm kind of screwed. Um, so first I need to find some gravel. Right, is there any gravel around here? Let's see, there sh should be some around here. Um, as long as we find gravel then we're kind of set to go to the nether. Try see if we can find another fortress. So far we've been quite lucky with the seed. Um, but there might be some gravel down this way? No. This way? No. Ah, okay. Um, okay. Let's see if there's any down here. This might actually not be so good. <gasps> Gravel! Nice! Right, so we only need a couple of blocks so we can start going for flint. We've got flint! Nice. Right, so now I just need to go over here, make some steel. And hopefully this lights. No, it doesn't. Ah, uh, no. Right, um... Okay, so let's see if we can make an... Um, I'm not sure why this isn't lighting. Oh well. Right, let's, um... Try another one. See if we can actually make a decent nether portal this time. So we need to go three up. Got how nether portals worked. Right, and then we need to move our water over here. Hopefully this doesn't destroy too much lava. Right, that's all set. We can we can just come down here, wait for this to disperse and light the portal. Ah, uh, no, we need do more here, right, okay. So we need that one, then that one. We've just got enough lava. Ah, nice. So we can go to another now, see if we can find... find our way into another fortress. Hopefully there's one nearby. If there's not, then we're kind of screwed. Um, there is one nearby. Um, so that's good. First thing we need to do is we need to collect some cobblestone. Um, else we won't be able to find our way back. 
and that won't be very helpful when finding endermans. So let's come over here, just gra gather ourselves a bit of cobblestone. I am lagging quite a bit, which is unlike me for a um, single player world anyway. So this is going to be a diamondless let's play where well, it's like no diamonds used even though I'm I got one it doesn't really count because it's still diamondless I'm not using any diamonds so um let's what was that nether fortress it was this way okay so you might be able to just head there on foot this might be good right let's uh, so, um take a um screenshot of the coordinates so I know how to get back um, or we could just could just um, do some coal stone going this way um, so it, we only really need to dig in don't we because then we can just head to the blaze spawn room um, and then be good Right, so we need to find some chests because we might be able to find some golden stuff in here. We can make a golden apple. So if we come up here, if we go down here. This. Do I hear a blaze or? No, I don't hear a blaze. Um, right, so we can grab this nether wall. I'm not sure what we'd use it for might be useful. Um, we can grab the soul sand for if we ever wanted to fight the wither on the speedrun world. Um, but first thing we need to do is we need to find the blaze spawner because else we're not going to be able to go to the end. Right. I see a magma cube that's not really helpful. Um, ah there's a blaze over there. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to be very tactful about how we deal with this. Right so Let's let's get some torches, put them in our offhand. Because I don't have any more wood. Which is a bit useless on my part. Um But if we just come up down here for a little hidey spot then we can kind of Nope. Nope! <laughs> um I'm not going to be able to do anything while that blaze is there. We'll see if we can lure him over this way. Or just um, kill this guy. Um, we just now need to kill this guy. We've Locked off that blaze spawner. Um, right. So we haven't got any blaze powder yet. Blaze blaze rods. So if there's one blaze over here. That we might not be able to do anything with. Cause he's all the way over there, but we did get that. Or I was thinking of another world. Yeah, I was thinking of another world. I was thinking of the survival world for some odd reason. Right, so we just need to sit here. Oh, shh! I'm dead. <laughs> oh, we're not dead. We're so alive. Right. We just need to. Now just wait here, I think, just try and heal up. Um, it would have been more sensible if we brought some food, but we've got some apples. Um, I'll just wait here and heal up for a bit. Right. So let's see if we can fight this guy. Right, we got we got one blaze. Oh shit, no. Ah, uh, I've got two blaze powder. That's very very. Um, um. Right. Okay. 
We've got literally no food left other than two raw potatoes which aren't that useful. What I don't like is how far the blaze can see you from. Can I get that guy? No! No! That's good, right. I think this is going to be how we get our blaze rods. We just like... Oh no, can I hear a wither skeleton? If I... If I do, then I'm so screwed. I'm so alive. Right, this is just gonna be... Oh no! <laughs> this is so dangerous. <laughs> oh, I'm actually scared. Right, let's cook. Let's cook these buds, or just eat this rotten flesh. Seriously, right? I can heal it from this, which is good. Um. Oh my gosh. Right. That blaze over there is driving me insane. Right. Just try and kill him. Just kind of run around. Not even fighting him. Right, there's a guy over there. He's so dead. Um Oh my goodness, right, um Ah, so he's on he's on land. We're fine with that. Um Right, so we've got another blaze rod. We only need like twelve. What's we, yeah, we only need a um, like 12 blaze powder to be able to complete this. Unless we're really unlucky with our end portal. Um, but for now I think we're good for um, finding blaze. We might we might break one of the torches, see if we can get some spawning, but um, not too many. Oh shit! I'm so dead. Oh no! I. Oh 